Welcome back to my channel. Today we will discuss on Prelab for Experiment for Magnetic Field. So the learning outcome is at the end of this lesson, students will be able to explain the experiment to determine the value of the horizontal component of the Earth magnetic field B. Okay, so for question number one, what is the meaning of magnetic field? Magnetic field is said to exist in a region if there is a magnetic force. Okay, so what is the symbol and SI unit of magnetic field? So the symbol here is B and the SI unit we use Tesla. Number three, what is the magnitude of the Earth magnetic field and is important in the daily life? So the magnetic Earth, uh, magnitude of the Earth magnetic field B is five exponent negative five Tesla, and the animal use the magnetic field during the migration. Okay, so this is the uh, important in the daily life. Okay, what are other sources of magnetic field? Current carrying conductor or permanent magnet. Okay, without the current in the solenoid, the compass needle is pointed to the north direction. Why the needle is deflected from the north when there is no there is current in the solenoid? Okay, okay, without current, compass needle point north to show the Earth magnetic. However, when the current is flowing in the coin, deflection indicates that there is another source of magnetic field by the coin. Okay, so if it deflected, for example, let's say this is our initially uh, our needle is point to the north. Okay, so let's say this is north. Okay, it point to the north, and this one we call it as magnetic field of the Earth, huh? BE. Okay, so when we on the power supply and when the current is flowing through, okay, when the current is flowing through, so meaning that automatically this solenoid will become uh, electromagnet. Okay, so this solenoid it will become this will be north pole, this one will be south pole. Okay, so therefore it will produce a magnetic field which is come up from the north. Okay, and then entering the south. Okay, so it will produce a magnetic field which is come up from the north pole okay and then enter to south pole okay so for this case meaning that initially we have so initially we have the earth magnetic okay so when we on the power supply it will produce another magnetic field by the solenoid okay so at the end the needle of the compass it will deflect it. okay so it will deflect it in the angle of theta okay so later you will see the compass here it will deflect it. Okay, so from the diagram above, state that the relation between the Earth magnetic field and also uh, B from the coin, okay, where tangent theta is equal to B coin over B Earth. Okay. Okay. Next, since B C B coin is equal to mu naught n i over D, derive from tangent theta in terms of B and i. Okay. So if we substitute inside our B C, therefore we will get tangent theta equals to mu naught n over d b e times the current okay so this is the equation later we will use it to plot the graph okay experiment okay the manipulative variable is the current responding is the angle of deflection constant variable here is the number of turns and the earth magnetic field strength okay next we continue what is the relation between magnetic field of the coin and the number of turns okay so actually it is actually directly proportional because we know that b is directly proportional to n where b is for the coin is equal to mu naught n i over d okay how do we set up a solenoid with the real start emitter power supply and switch inlet so or we must connect it in series circuit okay what is the functions of decreasing the resistance of the real start okay so it's actually help us to increase the current and corresponding value of angle because when we adjust the resistance current will also change okay so when the current change uh, the angle of the deflections of the compass it will also change okay so this one is how we use the uh, compass or that okay next we'll go to data analysis and equations of the straight line graph y equals to mx plus c where y is the quantity of vertical exit and x is a so this is actually x is the quality quantity on the horizontal exit okay so from here what is the meaning of m and c in a straight line okay so m is actually is a m is the gradient c is the y-intercept okay from the equation here tangent equals to mu naught n i over d b okay how do we transform equation one so that we can plot a straight line graph relating this variable angle and the electric current Okay, so from here, if you compare uh, y equals to mx plus c, okay, so here this is the answer where tangent theta is y exit, r is x exit, therefore mu naught 
N over DB is actually our gradient. Then how do we determine the value of B from the graph? Okay, so as we know, the gradient is equal to mu naught n over dB. Therefore, B is equal to mu naught n over dM, where m is the gradient. Okay, trial state two precautions of this experiment. Okay, so number one, carry out experiments in an isolated environment because the surrounding magnetic field, for example, mobile electrical wiring, may affect the finding reading of the experiment. So keep away any electric electronic equipment, okay? Because we know that when the current flowing through a conductor automatically it produces a magnetic field. Okay, so make sure that we must keep away any electronic equipment. Okay, so that's all for this pre-lab. See you on next video. Bye.